Well, but, I, I, I want everybody to like go back, like rewind, because you can see yeah. Lisa do this so many times and it's so awesome because she uses herself as an example. So she's yeah. actually telling people all about exactly what she does in examples. And so therefore yeah. it doesn't, it's not like, hey, I have this new event and it's coming out and you guys should come to it. Because right. then you're this right. skeezy person that hops on in 10 minutes and like goes yeah. and does it. But for my, you, you're like, oh, just like what we do. Ta-da. It's so simple. Which my, I love. my girlfriend, she calls that whole like old way, the Lamiaf Club. It, it's an acronym she made up for look at me. I'm so fabulous. Where we like stick testimonials up on the screen and talk about all the wonderful things we did. Yeah, look at me, and, look at me. You know, You can use those. It's just we show you how to use testimonials and case studies in a way that's client focused instead of you focused. And and that's what changes the energy. That's what changes the feel. So no longer do I want to avoid your question, Jamie. I'm really excited to share with you guys. So now, you know, we have to first distinguish what's an offer, right? The unique transformation you provide plus how you provide it, simply put. Um, So now how do we make that offer irresistible, right? And what I'm going to share with you now, what's exciting is you can use what I'm going to share with you one-on-one, but it also works really well on live stages or group presentations. It also works really well virtually, like on a teleseminar or a webinar or an interview. And it, it comes down to distinguishing three, okay, one, two, three, three elements that, that make up not just an offer, but an irresistible offer. So this is the kind of the writer downer part, or again, it's all distinguished even further in the book, which is why it's a perfect match with today. So the first one is we call the main dish. You've got to know of my irresistible offer, what's the main dish? And the main dish is really that piece that I just shared with you. It's the outcome plus how you provide it. So there's some way you give that. Is it the 90 days of coaching, the three-day seminar? Is it your digital course or coming into your office for, you know, three months of visits? So that on its in and of itself, we're calling that the main dish. It's kind of like a plate, right? I mean, that's the, that's the steak, right? <laughs> so um, what makes it irresistible is adding the second and third step. So the second step is what we call bonuses, now, there's a whole lot of different schools of thought and train and thinking and a little bit some old school stuff out there with mm-hmm. bonuses. So I kind of want to give you the update of what we find really works. And, you know, I, I just want to share, like, why might you listen to me? We've done over $30 million of sales, like from my home with two toddlers in tow. Well, the toddlers are now nine and 12. But when I started, they were a newborn and a three-year-old. And we have clients in 134 countries, right? And we've been honored by the Inc. 500 um, list of fastest growing privately held companies two years in a row. So it's working. Like what I want to share with you, I just want to give you some confidence that it's working. And it it works now for for thousands of people in like every kind of business. So um, here it is. So the bonuses, um, contrary to what you may be seeing out there a lot, it's actually most powerful When you're making your offer to couple your main dish with with bonuses, and and I like to use two rules, few and tightly related. 